Hello everyone, good day and welcome to my channel. My name is Joseph Ocheme, the content creator of Fullness of Channel. Today I'm going to um, go into teachings on the Fullness Generator. So today um, it is going to be series by series. I'm going to give you guys um, the teachings on Fullness Generator. And the key point to note here is that please, this presentation, this um, illustration, any illustration I'm to give, during the series of this Fuller Generator um, training is not going to be practical. It's just going to be a theory-based um, teaching. So please, if you are here looking for a practical, real practical demonstration, you are not going to see a practical demonstration here, but it's going to be a theoretical training on this my section. Um, along the line, if there is a need for a practical demonstration, it is going to be shown. So. Um, the series of the foilless generator training has started. So today I'm here to expose one of the teachings to you before we go deep into the series of teachings. So I'm just here to bring an announcement that from now um, for the for the next um, for from now to the end of this month, I'm gonna bring a teaching on the foilless generator. But today we are going to talk about the foilless generator itself. We are going to talk about the foilless generator itself. Now, what is the foilless generator? The foilless generator is an, um, a machine that doesn't use fuel. Practically, an engine that doesn't use fuel. So, what uh, will be used as the mechanical part will be an electric motor, a DC motor, and anything that can cause or a rotation that doesn't use fuel. That is what is regarded as fuelless generator as long as it can produce light for example we have an alternator most people use an electric motor to spin it to bring light most people use a dc motor to spin it to bring light most people use a mechanical rotation in whatsoever means to spin it so many people use uh, a water engine electrolysis to spin it also so all those things are being categorized as the fuelless generator so i've come to tell you guys today that there are different ways in which you can hook up your fuelless generator there are different ways which you can do it to actually work effectively so if you guys um, take a good look at um, some of the videos on internet most of the videos on internet actually depict um actually depict fuelless generator but they are not giving you the details in it so many people pass an underground wire in order for them to claim to you that foliage generator is real, foliage generator is like this and the rest of them. Most of them use it as a YouTube advertising so as they can have more views on it. But that is not where I'm going to today. Where I'm going to is to expound to you, to expose or to, to, to bring to knowledge to you what this foliage generator actually means. Now... For example, if you check below of my videos, I've demonstrated some, some things about the foliage generator. I've talked about the DC motor. I've talked about the electric motor. I've talked about the alternator. I've talked about so many things that will help you or that will guide you into the foliage generator making. So today, that is just uh, what foliage generator is. A device or a generator that doesn't use fuel in any way. So that is what a foolish generator is. So in our next um, series of teachings, I'm going to expound to you. Um, most of the things which we are going to do, we're going to talk about alternators. We're going to talk about electric motors. We're going to talk about um, we're going to talk about balancing. We're going to talk about various things on the foolish generator. So please don't miss this teaching. Always stay tuned. Do subscribe to these videos. So you can see any videos which I post. So this is just a brief demonstration. This is not what I'm. This, this is not the teaching though. But in the in my next video, I'm going to bring out series of teachings. So this video is just an awareness to you that I'm bringing up a teaching series for you guys, which is not practical based but theoretical based, which is going to help you a lot. So please subscribe to this channel, give your comments below on what you feel about this. Thank you so much. Thank you.